What's up, you nerds? Welcome back to a brand new video. I haven't been streaming or uploading. We've just been extremely busy. And the eBay store, it's been doing fine. We've been selling a lot of stuff. I just haven't, I don't feel like making videos of the sales, really. More of the stuff we pick up, and if something crazy, then we'll have an update on that. But anyways, guys, in today's video, we went out to Goodwill, St. Vincent de Paul, and the Valley first store we have here locally. Yes. And uh, I spent a total of 18 uh, beautiful dollars. And the profit is going to be beautiful. We should be making at least $155 off the items we bought today. And that's low-balling the um, items, actually. So it may be, I say $155, it may actually be $180 to $200. Which is still, you know, more money, the better. Anyways, I'm going to go, on, go ahead and show you guys what the items were. Alright guys, starting off, we have this Looney Tunes... Marvin the Martian, uh, picture frame, brand new. I paid two dollars. I just listed it for nineteen ninety nine. Moving on, I'm just gonna do it like this so we can have a video done quick. We actually got a um, from Clifford. I completely forgot the name of this, but I bought it for a dollar. It goes for ten bucks, so that's the number five bucks, which is amazing. This Ashley hates. Face is a little dirty, so I gotta try to clean it. But it's a Teletubby, which is awesome because Teletubbies was one of the best shows as a kid. Next thing's actually a. Uh, there's one thing actually here. Ignore that because we're gonna talk about that in a minute. We got this 19. Uh, what was it? 19. Let's spin this around. 1978, right there. Garfield Christmas jar, which is pretty cool. Even if we don't sell it, that's actually really cool. Just for something to display for Christmas and such. And I think Spider bit me. Ignore that. All right, moving on. We actually put away a couple things already. Um, actually found this pretty cool brand. Which I'm gonna be looking out for. It's a uh, hot dogs. It's basically um, that's the title of art basically. But it's, uh, Borders Fine Art. And this right here, I paid two fifty four. Posted for twenty four ninety nine. And actually bought something else with it, which is oh my god. All right, so it's a Fox Bronze Vintage Bulldog statue. And this thing was uh, five dollars at my store, and I was like, that's really cool and interesting. So I went ahead and looked it up. And right now in auction, there's one going for 50. It has six hours left, so I'm watching what, how it's actually going to turn out. And it looks like ugly. Let's do that. But um, a buy it now listing has it on for like 200 and something. So I went ahead and tossed mine up for 150 dollars. And like best offer, like I'd take 100. I mean anything, making money is amazing. And then we do have something that I actually find pretty cool. I'm not really into candles though. Otherwise, I would totally keep it. We got a if I don't break the glass. Egyptian um, candle holder, which is really cool. It was only uh, two dollars and it was twenty five percent off, so we actually paid a dollar fifty for it. But that's pretty lit. All right, moving on. We actually have this big thing. Uh, Lucas has been loving Paw Patrol, and I went ahead and went to my work because I knew they had one, so I bought one for him. And then I found another one for five dollars, so I bought it to resell because I paid more than five dollars for mine. So I am very mad, very very mad about that. So I went ahead and bought the other one just to resell locally. Because any amount of money is money. Hey right, guys, so that is the items I bought. I've been uh, trying. I sell a lot of toys. A ton of toys. I've been trying to get away from that because there's items with tons of value everywhere you go. And I gotta start finding those as well instead of just the same old stuff. But it's working. Selling toys works. We're making a killing off of it. But that right there is one good haul considering there was no toys to buy except for those little stuffed animals and the Paw Patrol boat. But anyways, moving on to story time. Someone bought a Power Ranger from us off eBay and it was hilarious. They left us feedback and what they said, they left a positive feedback. But what it said was they shoved it up their A hole, which is very messed up. Obviously they spelled up a word, but I'm not going to say it. But I was, it was hilarious because I called, um, I called eBay to have it taken off and the lady was trying her hardest not to laugh because that was just a, such an interesting uh, feedback to have, I'd say. But yeah, that's a hilarious weird thing that happened. I guess that's what you do with Power Rangers, if you guys, if, if you guys didn't know. When you go to flea markets and you see Power Rangers, do not touch them. Anyways, hopefully you guys are doing amazing. Hopefully I'll be streaming soon. Uh, like I said, we, I've been trying to. It's just stuff is extremely busy around here lately. So yeah, hopefully you guys have a great day, and I'll hopefully have another video up soon, and I'll be streaming, hopefully, I work five days straight, so, I don't know about that, but hopefully soon. Anyways, enjoy your night, day, evening, morning, and be remembered to stay nerdy. Deuces, guys.